Hello, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are watching this. Um, that's probably something that's very commonly said often um, in, the, in the age of remote learning and distance learning. I think this quarter has been been a, been a handful, I think more than more, much more than a handful in, in getting used to all the all the formats and all the mobile platforms I have to have to get adjusted to and also transition to University of Washington academic schedule for freshman fall quarter. I think everything didn't go well. Everything that that could that could have went wrong did go wrong. However, I think that things could have been much, much worse in terms of, I guess, academics or or perhaps luck in classes getting canceled sometimes or perhaps sporting events getting canceled or or actually managing to meet with my resident advisor many times and also also to get caught up on assignments. I think all in all my my time here at UW has been very very hectic, but I feel that finding community is was very important. And for me, how I found that was through through Maple Hall Council because in the beginning of the school year, I mean even before it started even before the school year started, I there was an opportunity to apply for a residence hall council, and I did. I applied, didn't think I would get accepted, but I did get accepted um, to an interview, and I interviewed, and and you, and what do you know? I got in. So plenty of, I guess, a lot of my pursuits this quarter have been um, both extracurricular and and academic, I feel that maybe taking overloading myself this quarter in terms of, I guess, taking computer science 142, math 125, and well, I actually think math 20, 125 was the easiest, and taking my engineering fig was the hardest. But I think it's it was a good experience because I really didn't protect myself or, I guess, in a sense, play too passively this quarter. I have, I have made, mis made my mistakes and I've uh, made some improvements to, I guess, time management and note-taking. In fact, of note-taking, I found that I now take notes in cursive whenever I write super fast. And that was, that was really surprising because I actually never I actually never mas mastered cursive when trying to when trying to write. I just loosen my grip on my pencil and then the cursive, the really I guess okay, the really okay cursive. So it's not it's not read much very read it's not very readable cursive, but it does get the job done. Sometimes I take up to 16 pages of notes in my notebook. Cornell style, of course. I felt I feel that maybe um maybe taking remote maybe taking classes remotely isn't so bad. Whenever I can, I can stay engaged by taking notes, and also um, going to office hours. I feel that's something I I have a regret of this quarter, um, freshman fall quarter was that I didn't go to office hours enough for my computer science class because I don't know, I was afraid that just asking for help was gonna make me look stupid. And that's that's pretty much the reality of of life. Sometimes you, you need to ask you need to ask for help when you need it. Um, it's not you have to just swallow your pride and and go call for help because um, calling for help shows that you're actually resourceful, and and I don't think um, 
I don't think being called stupid is is something to, to really be afraid of because I don't think anyone really cares. Not to say that some people at UW have been a very, very asocial and some some I've some people I've met are are very great people. Some, on the other hand, don't don't greet me back when I greet them as I'm passing them by. And I find that to be a little bit strange, but I guess it's Seattle, and I guess there's a little bit of that Seattle freeze. However, I didn't let that I didn't let that get in the way of trying to make new friends this quarter. I feel that sometimes it's it's best to just go out on a go out on the wire, and also, of course, put on my mask so I can so I can leave my room and to in order to. Um, do my errands, do laundry, or get food, because in this age there's no need to, I guess, step outside of the, step outside of my dorm or wherever, wherever other students live, whether it be in the apartments, yeah, jeez, um, Greek, Greek Grow, I know Greek Grow has done some of the worst things in terms of, I guess, um, in terms of the coronavirus, but I'm glad I'm not part of part of um Greek. Um. Anyways, back to back to some clubs I've joined was um, I guess I no I guess I did join quite quite a few ex either commitments or extracurriculars. I mean, one of them was Maple Hall Council. Which is residence hall council that this that advocates for the on the behalf of residents, and also connects to some representatives who talk on the behalf of the student senate, or tuition and fees, or or I guess the board of the board of um, finances, and they decide whether. They should cut the rates or decide who who needs to go to uh, talk with HFS. Um, how's it, who needs to talk with U, um, University of Washington's Housing and Food Services and other great things like that. I am I'm glad to say that I've also participated in a STEM. ASB program. I applied in November and I was accepted. I was accepted to a teaching program and what what that meant was I could well I need to do training for winter through winter quarter just take a little seminar class and also go teach virtually for five days to high schoolers at Toppenish. Toppenish, Washington, so teach at, teach rocketry. And one of the projects related to that is building a model rocket. Um, last time I checked, because we had, we, had a, uh, we had quite a few documents that were shared, and we also needed to um, go over them over winter break, even though um, it might sound a little bit ironic that I'm taking, um, having homework over over winter break. However, I, I'm i glad that next quarter my classes are gonna be much, well, what I have planned for now are is much, much easier. I have just two STEM courses and, 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 and um, two non-STEM courses, those being English, drama, education, and also math. Because as an engineering major, I will have to be satisfying my placement requirements. And that, my friends, can be a little bit of a pain. And perhaps maybe combined with the fact that days get super, super short here in Seattle can be a little unnerving. But I do get through that by finding a group of friends and good community.